Before I properly start this commentary, I'd like to tell everyone and notify them that I smell like rabbit cum. Now, that will come in later in the commentary. So, what is up, people? And this gameplay is old, so if you've seen it before, good for you. And this is my SLX TNT Terrorith, I don't know his name anymore. And where have I been? Six days, no commentary, no gameplay. Nothing! Nothing! Well, I don't even I don't even know where I have been. I haven't played uh, Call of Duty for four days. I've turned my Xbox on. Give me credit for that one. Even though my Xbox, I have, since my old Xbox died, I have the new one. Right? Which has like the uh, touch, like turn on and off button or whatever. Terrible idea. I fart and that thing goes off. That's how powerful my ass is. I spread my cheeks and let it out. That's totally irrelevant to this commentary. So what this gameplay is, it's terribly old. I mean, this is like four months old or something like that. But I didn't have any gameplays and I always turn to TNT for gameplay. He says he has, ooh, 70 anti gameplays. I don't want an anti gameplay TNT. I want some actual gameplay. And if we're pointing fingers and naming names, I'm blaming him for not recording any gameplay for the last six days because the reason I didn't do a commentary is we know my HD PVR doesn't work and it's not my PVR, it's actually the laptop. And nobody bothered recording a gameplay. And I'm not going to go out of my way and ask because, you know, that could, that could be rude. So, he didn't record me any gameplays. So, you know, it's, it's the problem. So this is a one, I, I don't know if I've said it yet, this is a 103 gun streak. <laughs> Never broken. But, here, let me get to this. 103 gun streak by TNT for the fourth fucking time on Hijacked. Four months old, four or something months old. He's got the Vibrator Finger FAL because he plays on Claw. If you think this is a mod, you know, go to his channel. It should be in the description on the screen. If I remember, if I don't remember, I don't know. I have too much rabbit come on me at the moment, so I do not know what I'm uh, doing. So, you know, I, I should do another story time video because the one, the only one I ever did was I suck at golf. That was pretty entertaining. Now, if you doubt that this is a hundred gun streak, by all means, get your lazy ass off, get your lazy ass, whatever, and just count every kill, starting from the nuke. Watch him get the nuke clear, and then count how many is that? 73 afterwards. Now, this is pretty impressive. People have come close, I think 98, 100, uh, somebody got 103. It's a terrible player. I don't even know who it was. I watched that gameplay, it's terrible. It, it shouldn't even be called a 103 gun streak, it should be called a 50 gun streak with 40 C4 throws, getting you uh, 40 more kills, you know? I hate C4. Now, you, you might call me hypocritical, why is there so many C4 gameplays on this channel? Sorry, I don't have a filter. You know, I don't have a condom on the gameplays to keep them away. I know a lot of people do use the C4, and I am completely bought out that C4 is required to get triple nukes, because I haven't, I've, I've seen one triple nuke without C4, and that was because he was just sitting on this side of the map the whole time against Randy's, and these people are terrible. Honor that fact, they're terrible. God. What do I, I'm going to talk about where I've been. Let's just say... People just seem to be uh, attached to my balls, you know. If I'm gone for a while, like, where'd you go? Where'd you go, bro? So uh, I haven't gone anywhere. I actually got a new rabbit. I have I have one already. So I got another one. This one is three and a half years old because I uh, I like the older ones, you know. I'm I'm uh, gotta get in my age group. I like the older rabbits because they are a lot nicer, and I don't feel like waiting for them to grow up. So this one's fat as fuck. He's huge. It's so funny. You you give him a plate of like you know lettuce. He's like, ha, ha, ha. he's like your typical Call of Duty uh, commentator walking over to the uh, leaf uh, lettuce whatever it is. Ha, 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 ha. Sounds like some fat orgasm when he's trying to go because he makes this sound. Like, ha, ha. You, you, you hear enough about it. So I got him I think two days ago. I've been watching him just walk around my room. It's pretty entertaining. He's so big that he can literally jump on my bed. It scared the hell out of me. And uh, I introduced him to my other one. Big ass mistake. Not doing that again until they're uh, fixed. They just had like, you know, I guess it's it's two males, right? And with bunnies, their hormones make humans look, you know, sterile. And these things are just 
humping each other like crazy. It's unbelievable. They're like, <laughs> and the fat one, like, <laughs> I know these sound effects may be getting annoying, but it's for realism. Now these these rabbits are just going at it. I'm watching them like, <laughs> so I I do eventually spread them up. They come everywhere. Well, you don't see it actually. It's just when I touch them, you can feel it's on there because you the smaller one that I have, it's only like six months old. He was dominating. Give him. He's got the like, he's got the young domination winning winning over that fat fuck jesus christ but the big one is awesome and also i don't know if he's aggressive or what is it i'm not the uh rabid guru but when i get up once in a while you know let's say uh what's it called ah fuck shit when, when i walk in my room and he's laying down he gets up he does the uh, fat wheezing thing and then he'll start circling my legs mount his he's got a dick trust me it's pretty big for a little rabbit because i just lift the tail up and he's like ha ah. and he mounts my legs and starts humping me that's what i meant when i'm uh covered in rabbit cum because for whatever reason i guess he loves my leg and he humps my leg so i gave him a little stuffed animal lizard so he keeps humping that he, he's a really damn active rabbit i give him credit for that and if you were expecting me to finish that uh, commentary topic, Triple Nuke Week, it kind of fell through the floor. Maybe I'll continue it this week or whatever. If somebody records me gameplays, god damn it, just somebody. Somebody please record me a fucking gameplay. Um, so the rabbit is pretty nice, you know. I mean, he does like being pet. He walks up to me and just puts his head there like, pet me on the head. If, if he could talk. I mean, he does talk. He does the, like, uh, queefing sound. That's that's what I'm gonna say. It is. It's a queefing while walking with your ass fat in your vagina. Now, that might not be the prettiest image, but that's probably what it sounds like. I don't have any first-person witnesses of that kind of scenario. I know there's a lot of people who probably have that problem, but you know, it's it's fine. And what else could I do? You know, I mean, there is a uh, new skin packs or whatever coming out. Which is quite unfortunate because I could care less. Maybe they should start fixing the game instead of trying to make more money on it. It's unbelievable. You know, I thought it was just Infinity Ward who wants money. Because uh, last Call of Duty, you know, Call of Duty Elite. I thought that was a terrible idea at first. I mean, it's not bad even though the maps. Multiplayer. Oh, this is something I've been trying to address. But I keep forgetting to address. It's, uh, would you rather have zombie map DLC or multiplayer map DLC? You know? I would actually rather have, if I had to have multiplayer maps, good maps from previous Call of Duties. Four, five, uh, six, you know, even Black Ops 1. I'd rather beat half the price. I mean, I'd still pay for them because they're maps I know, I played on it. Instead of just remaking them into a modern tone like Studio, I think that's what it is, of Firing Range. It's just a clusterfuck of special effects and filmography. It's weird. I don't like it. So just keep it as it was. Put it at half price. It's not hard to make these maps. I don't know why they're so overpriced. I have made two zombie maps. And they only took me about a week each. They're not complete and they're terrible. But they still... Somebody who's completely inexperienced at them and uh, isn't in a full team who works 24-7 could make them in a week. So tell me what a team could do. They're probably just circle jerking and they're like oh, how can we make more money <laughs> you know and also the other side of that is if would you rather have multiplayer maps or a combination of zombies and multiplayer and oh, oh whoops one more option just zombie maps i would rather have just zombie maps honestly three zombie maps per pack that suit me i don't even play the multiplayer maps i have to buy them for the damn zombie map even, guarantee it buried was a good map i had fun but, and of course, uh, it died. It died quicker than fuck. These maps need to be bigger, like Alcatraz. I think that was my favorite map in a while, since uh, the World of War maps. That was pretty good. But, I don't even know the final score of this game, so, you know, if you could be generous enough to figure it out for me. Whoa, good girl. And I'm also thinking of doing another quad com on Buried. Not another, but another quad com, but it's not another on Buried, you know? The other one was on Die Rise. I looked back at it, because somebody was playing through the mic. That was funny as fuck. Now, if you don't find that funny, well, oh well. I'm a Duracell battery. That's, that's a quote from the video. 